Hello, this is Talia Andrews and welcome to TD's Travel Channel UK edition. Visit Britain, the National Tourism Agency, is to cut its staff workforce by up to 30% in response to budget cuts by the coalition government. Up to 70 posts in areas such as finance, IT, HR and communications will face the axe in a bid to address the 34% cut to Visit Britain's budget announced in October last year. Other changes will include reducing functions, activity and the number of international markets in which Visit Britain has a presence, which will fall from 35 to only 21. TripAdvisor has revealed that Tunisia has seen a 19% uplift in online traffic. The Foreign Office lifted its warning against all non-essential travel to the country last week, which has stimulated travel interest in the region once again. Of the 3,000 TripAdvisor users surveyed in the four days following the FCO stance, nearly one in five were interested in returning to the North African country. The International Air Transport Association has called on the government to take a global approach to air transport or risk destroying the proud legacy of British aviation. In a speech to the Aviation Club in London, Giovanni Bassani, Director General and CEO of AETA, urged Britain to be more competitive in the market as air travel provided critical global connectivity. Marriott has announced a new addition to its Renaissance Hotels portfolio, the 221-room Renaissance Antibes One Le Pin Hotel in the south of France. The hotel ambassador will be rebranded a Renaissance Hotel under a management agreement with Jester Group. The new property will join the soon-to-open JW Marriott Hotel Khan as Marriott continues to grow its presence on France's famed Côte d'Azur. And finally, in today's news, Rail Europe has reported 2010 as a record trade sales year with bookings up 20% year on year. The company's sales have more than doubled following the launch of its dedicated trade website. Paul Lacey, new head of trade sales at Rail Europe, said that demand for train travel had grown significantly since last year. And that's it for today. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again tomorrow.